right, how's everybody doing out there? This is Bad 66 Chevelles here. I'm just cruising in my Durango here. And uh, this is going to be a little different video here. But, uh, you know, I'm going to make it kind of short and sweet. But just the way things are going right now and with my, you know, my land and everything and just everything is not exactly going the way I want it. Uh, I'm actually going to end up, uh, well, I think we're going to go on and move today because it's just the way things are getting. Money is just so tight. It really is. And, you know, this is, you know, this is a real video. I'm just like everybody else out there struggling, you know, trying to make it and everything. But, you know, it's just kind of gotten to the point now I can't afford two places anymore. I really can't. So I'm on today is going to be the official moving day. We're going to move to our land, and then uh, we're going to take in. Uh, we're going to get out of that old place because that's the best thing to do. And I just, you know, I have to make a decision, and you know, I'm not losing the land. So, and once we get down there, you know, everything's going to be okay. You know, I'll be able to afford it. I just can't afford. You know the land payment plus rent. I mean, it's just it's crazy. And then the problem too is my landlord just will not work with me. That's what makes me mad. And I've talked to her and talked to her like, you know, probably tell him blue in the face. But you know, it's just to the point anymore where you know I'm just gonna have to you know pay her at the end. You know, it might take a month or two, but I'm gonna move today. And then a month or two from now, I'm just going to have to catch it up then. And then the bad part about it, too, is that mobile home has been on that lot since it was brand new. It's a 74 Concord mobile home. And long story short, everybody around this area is wanting two to $3,000 just to take that thing to the dump because it's old, it's falling down, it's got a lot of issues just about everything you think of is wrong with it you know it's got electrical issues it's got the roof leaking it's got the floor rotting out i mean it just it really needs to go to the dump it's not worth fixing and you know i can't sell it because the landlord you know won't let me you know i gotta respect that that is her land you know i have land too so i have to respect that but i just i really don't know what i'm gonna do about that i actually thought about taking and getting to my pickups and backing up to it and you know, and take the chainsaw, cut it up, and haul it off piece by piece. But it's just it's awful anymore. It really is. You know, I feel like I'm trapped basically because that's what makes me mad and burns me up too. Is that mobile home sitting on that lot? Even if it's you know tore down and ready to go, it's sitting on wheels. She's still going to charge rent. And I've done had the discussion with her about it. And it's just it's ridiculous. She won't work with me. But I just, you know, it's time to move. I'm going to take it. I'm going to move to my land. You know, it's no point putting it off anymore. And then I'm just going to have to catch everything up at the end. You know, that's just the way it's going to have to be. But I just want to make it. So it's actually good news and it's bad news. But the good news is, you know, we're going to be uh, moving a lot faster. When I originally planned, I was actually only planning until around October 1st this year. That's when I was going to cut it off and you know, move down there either way. But we're going to have to do it now because it's just, I mean, it's just, I can't afford two places, basically. And it's caused me to get behind on everything. And then, you know, I get behind two, three months, and then it's going to make it very hard. And I'm not sitting there losing my land. And I've always paid my land on time, so I'm not going to lose that. So... We just gotta catch everything up at the end, but I just wanna make this little update video here and we got more videos to come. We're gonna make more truck videos and everything and you know I'm just tickled to death. I'm glad I got my sheds down there, I really am. So I'm on my buddy's hopefully gonna help me get a few more things situated so I can, you know, be able to stay down there. But we're gonna start staying down there, you know, today. So today is the official day we will be moving. So I hope you all enjoy these videos and there will be more to come. And thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll figure out how to make this because this is, you know, a real video. And I really, really appreciate y'all followers out there. Shout out to everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Y'all take care.